what a night, what a season. Champions League winner, treble winner, how does that all sound? It, <laughs> it sounds great, it sounds great. Uh, a special, very special achievement for, for all of us. Um, we'll forever be remembered for this. It's special to share it with our group, uh, a group of amazing, uh, amazing people, and all, all of them very deserving of, of what happened today. It, it was a very, very difficult uh, uh, way to, to get to here today, but we did it, and uh, we were very happy. What was it a harder game tonight than you expected, and you had to do it the hard way because you've lost Kevin De Bruyne again inside 35 minutes? Well, we, we always knew it was not going to be an easy game. Uh, it, it never is. It's a Champions League final, and for a team to arrive here, they, they must have done something really good. So we, we never got into the fantasy that we were the favourites or whatever. We always knew it was going to be a very difficult game, and, uh, and in the end, we were not wrong. Uh, that's what happened. We could have, uh, we could have uh, finished the game earlier with, uh, with some goals, but in the end, also, they had their chances. And, they did. Uh, were you nervous when they had those chances at the end? In the end, we're happy. We did it, and uh, we're happy that we, we, we've written history. Well done, Ruben. Congratulations. Congratulations, Mo. Simple question. How are you feeling? Um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm over the moon. I'm very rarely speechless, but um, my, my dream's just come true to achieve this with this club. For everything that they've done for every single one of us over the years, um, and to achieve a a treble, it, it, it's, it's unbelievable. Well, when you don't start in a game like this, we were talking about the feelings and emotions. Obviously, now you've won it, you've played a little part at the, at, at the end, and your part has been huge throughout this season for this team. How do you manage those emotions in the change room, being one of the leaders? It's exactly that, being a leader. Um, obviously, I'm, I'm always going to be disappointed when I'm not playing, but <clears throat> I have to make sure that I'm, I'm 33 now. <laughs> and. You know, my example sets on to the younger lads. So it was, you know, I, I made a speech before they went out. And, you know, I made, I was true to my words, you know, it was emotional, but, you know, this is, this club means so much to me. Um, I've been here six years now, but to give me what it's given me and to experience the experience that I've experienced in football, uh, I've been further, further in debt, further in debt with it. Look, I don't want to pry, we don't want to know the exact words, but what was the gist of what you wanted to put across to those players in that moment when you spoke to them? No, I, I said, you, you're, my dream's in your hands. It's as simple as that. No pressure, then. No pressure, there's no pressure. <laughs> there's no pressure, but you, you can't say that Inter Milan deserve it more than we did, or we deserve it more than Inter Milan did. We're both here by merit. You know, commiserations to them, but there's, there has to be a loser. And I said to the lads that, you know, we need to make sure that we leave everything on that pitch. We can't work as hard as we have done all season um, to throw it away. And, you know, I thought the lads dug deep tonight. You know, I think emotions play with it. I think the occasion is obviously going to get to you, but, you know, to come away with... I got a silver one last time, so to have a gold one is fantastic. Uh, how important it's to you, personally? We just saw you running around with your kids there. Me and Cecil were just saying, I'm so jealous that my kids were either not even thought about or just were really too young to acknowledge it. But to have your kids here, I could see the emotion in you when your kids come out there. What does that mean to you and your family, extended family yeah. in the stands? No. Listen, to, <clears throat> obviously, I'm living, I'm living the dream. My mum and dad are in the stand, and from where I've come from in Sheffield, it's not, it's not easy. I tell you that, it's not easy. So for them to be here, for my, you know, for me to experience them memories with them because I remember when my mum didn't have a pound for an ice cream van. So for it to be here, you know, experiencing this with me, God bless her, you know, I'm just so thankful. Good. Beautiful. What a guy, mate. What a guy. I'm getting emotional myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting emotional. Okay, let's just take it up a notch. <laughs> just, what's the drink, the drink yeah. of choice and what's your first track you're going to play <laughs> when you get in a hotel? Anything in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> Gareth, I'm sorry. <laughs> just give me anything in front of me, I'm just going to destroy it. I'm destroying it. <laughs> Kyle, Enjoy. you've done the treble. Congratulations, Thank man. You. Cheers. Thanks a lot, guys. Thank well you. done. Well done. They had to do it without you tonight, didn't they? <laughs> yeah. Um, well, it's... It's been a hard two months for me, you know, I've got a lot of uh, issues with my hamstring and it snapped, so uh, it is what it is. I did to, uh, everything to, to be okay and it's a shame because I felt really good in the first half an hour and I thought I was doing well, but, you know, the team is good enough and um, 
we won, so that's it. There's so much to celebrate. Let's have a look at the medal for a start. Manchester City, City's first ever. Yeah. This is going to go down in history. How, what does this mean to you? Well, it's, uh, it's amazing, you know. We've been working so long for this and to be part of this. You know, the history for the club and for, for everything that we did as a team, you know, uh, I think we, we fully deserve. We've not lost in the Champions League this year, so um, it wasn't the best game, but finals are always difficult and um, now it's time to celebrate. And to have the treble, the second English club treble, that is an incredible achievement. Yeah, obviously it's, it's, it's huge because, you know, the, the amount of games you have to play and um, the level that you have to be consistency is high but you know it's it's amazing we should enjoy it and that's it and i uh, hope your leg feels better big party tonight oh definitely no one's given away any secrets is it in the I hotel i even have no idea but it, uh, it's going to be more than one day i guess <laughs> <laughs> it's